Hi guys and welcome to the advanced one-handed tutorial module. In these videos I've just got a variety of advanced tips and techniques to help you improve your one-handed speed solving. The slight difference in this module from the beginner and intermediate modules is that we're going to have less of a focus on the mechanics and the finger tricks and the turning and more of a focus on the actual solutions that you're doing with one hand. So I'm going to make the assumption that you're already quite competent at turning the cube with one hand and, and you're pretty fast at that. Broadly speaking, there are a couple of differences between the best way to solve the cube with two hand and the best ways to solve the cube with one hand. The most obvious differences are the different finger tricks, rotations and algorithms that you'll use, but more subtle are the different ways that we can change our speed solves. So in one handed, you're turning a little bit slower and you have more capacity to look ahead. So that means you can potentially do slightly more fancy things during your F2L, as well as vary your approach to solving the last layer to adapt to executing, and executing those moves with one hand. This module starts out with a little bit of advice on improving your one-handed turning and then dives into F2L and last layer techniques that you can implement in your solves. 